Hey guys, welcome back in Korea Bangla YT and in this video, uh, there's a one more viewer comment, you know, request. So now we are making that. Uh, in my last video of UFO vehicle enter and this is great. He just commented, uh, he just commented me that, uh, can you made F button widget touch in drive? I think that he just tell me that by pressing keyboard, but I, I, you know, I don't, uh, goodly read the comment that, uh, that she say that touch okay i forgot that and i just comment that i already show in the video okay like on that video i just show by uh like pc inputs like when you press the keyboard of f your vehicle can be you can drive the vehicle so he just sent me in my uh, Mangla yt help group okay if you also have any problem you can send me pro uh, image in my Mangla yt help group just search in telegram that Mangla yt help or just search Kodi Bangla YT, you find my page, okay? Okay, as you can see, there is a uh, he sent me a PUBG v, uh, screenshot that he when he is near of any vehicle, okay? Then there will display the drive vehicle and get in the car, okay? However, for now, you'll be only set the get in the uh, drive the vehicle, okay? For do that, what will I, I already do that, so let me show you. It's not 100% correct, but it will be work. Okay, as you can see, there is a no button. But if I go any of vehicle near, there is a drive button coming. Okay, as you can see. And now, if I just you know uh, enable my computer cursor, and if I now just press this uh, drive button, I can now drive the vehicle. As you can see. Okay, now I can drive the vehicle without any pressing F keyboard, and I can come out from the car or my vehicle and pick any of vehicle which and uh, i already said okay as you can see i can select any vehicle or go any vehicle i can press the drive button and i can drive that vehicle okay so let me show you how i do that uh, how i did this so first of all what i did that i searched my player that my third person player okay or uh, in your case what is your character just search that one and at the character okay at the character folder i just create a new user interface that widget blueprint okay there's my widget blueprint and at the widget blueprint as you can see this is a, i add a button and at the button i add a simple text okay i set my button gravity to left sides okay so one is done i go at even graph and at the even graph what i did that on even construct get all the actor from the class and i get my third person character and get a copy from that just like that uh, copy and you find like this that get a copy just get this block and one is done i do that right mouse and promote a variable and I, I just get my third person player data to my this variable okay then i set that process uh, to uh, get player controller okay or if you want you can if you don't want you can't add also don't worry if it's not it's not necessary if you don't want that you can't uh, you don't need to add okay as you can see uh, it will be work no problem okay no problem i just m maybe mistakenly i add that okay however just need to get the variable one is done what i did that in my third person play, uh, player i at the event begin play i just call my widget that create a widget and i set my uh, ui or the widget in your case which one you create this one just select at here one is done at the return value just promote a variable and set it your ui name and then add it to your viewport then get your variable on this variable uh, the your widget reference and set that visibility to hidden okay so what i do at here that when our first time widget will be create it will be uh, hide the widget because we don't want that after the creating driving uh, when you are not near of vehicle it's always display okay so for do that thing stop so i hide the my widget okay that is code at here okay now at the drive that okay at the drive i select the button of the drive then scroll down and you find that even that on click it's mean that on we press this button on click it will be do work so at the event press as you can see i get my variable of my characters like which one i cre uh, get at here and from that i search that drive now now you have a question that bro why is the drive one but uh, what is this this is a function i already create or you can also you can call it a custom event let me show 
in my third person player character in our last video make sure that you see my this video the third person enter and exit vehicle so you find like this code and i all at that video i show that how you can set up this code so at our f keyboard while we are pressing the f press i just create a custom event that drive now it's only need to execute this function okay nothing else by a touch so by call that i just search that i, I created that drive now custom event and just plug with our near of vehicle okay that is the work at here then i search this thing in my widget area that uh, drive now function and we are when we press the drive button it will be should be execute this uh, code so for do that i just add at here okay one is done i also want that my uh, if you are press this button it's when we are now in driving so we don't want our widget to visible so i get my uh, widget of ui and set the visibility to hidden okay so that is the code at here so now you have a question that bro this is visible and non visible but how you said that when you are near of any vehicle at that time it will be visible the uh, variable or the our widgets so for do that what i did that let me show you that i search my vehicle which vehicle i want to f do that so i get my card three okay at the card three we know the, uh, we already created at our last test this video that I get, I get uh, near of we are verifying that are we are not are we are near of vehicle or not if we are near of vehicle we ca we want to drive the vehicle so for do that i get my player from the player i get the widget and set the visibility to visible and if you are not near of the vehicle it's always we should be height so if you are not near so it will be said that we are hidden okay that is the code so basically as a result when you are any near of any vehicle it will be get that vehicle reference and one is done it will be visible the our widget and now when we press the widget and we can drive the the vehicle okay that's all i hope you like if you have any question you can comment in my comment box i already give you this uh, project link description link below so you can easily download and yeah you can enjoy that so thank you so much for watching this love you all and bye bye have you a great day if you have also question you can comment in my comment box guys also don't forget to like share and subscribe